what's up so i'm going to show you two different ways of making pop today so i'm putting my powdered pop into the bowl that i'm going to use for the pop and then i just added three because that's the quantity i want three spoons and then i'm adding a little bit of water now this is the make or break one of the make or break points in making pop you need to be very careful about the consistency if you like your pop thick then your solution should be thick if you like your pop not so thick then your solution should not be so thick but not too watery there's a thin line between being too thick and too watery right so i'm still i still add a little bit of cold water to it and then it's okay for me now so i bring my hot water and then i add a little bit of hot water just to um mix up lighten the solution and then i now add my full um i now add more hot water to it and stir it keeping my eyes on the color of the pap the color of the pap is really important it's the color of the pap that will determine if your pap is ready and then because if you miss that one point between being too thick and too watery i will show you how to salvage that but then this is this i'm done now let's move on to guinea corn now guinea corn so dawa doesn't have um, a lot of starch as corn has the other um, pop I did was just a look on it has a lot of starch but this doesn't have so here is it I added a little bit of water as I showed paying attention to the consistency of my solution added more water when um, I needed to I felt it was still too thick I don't like to pop like I've said I like semi watery pop so I added um that was done and then I added hot water to it just a little bit so that I could lighten the consistency of the solution before now adding my full blown hot water to the mix. Now at this point the pap for me was already okay, but for the sake of um those people that would make the mistake or put too much hot water and then it becomes too watery that's why i added more water here so i'm adding water just to thicken sorry lighten the um consistency of the pap so i'm adding adding more water hot water so that it's really light so at this point it's really light for me and then what do i do take it to the fire so i put it on fire um, in my pot, my pot on the cooker, and then I'm stirring on low heat, continuous stirring. Please don't use an iron, iron spoon because obviously it will give you a little bit of lumps. But even if you use a wooden spoon or a plastic spoon, it's easier for you to stir adequately and then get the desired consistency. So pay attention to the consistency, pay attention to the color, and then you have it.